In this video, we are going to construct a congruent angle. We see that we have an angle named A, and we're going to start off by taking our straight edge tool. We're going to draw an initial ray for our angle. I've given it an endpoint. And now I'm going to take my compass tool. I'm going to place it on the original angle. I want to make sure that the compass tool is not too far open. I want to be able to make sure I hit both rays of the angle. And now I'll draw my arc through. And we see that there are two intersection points. I'm not changing the measurement of my compass. It's still the same distance. and we're drawing an arc through this initial side of our new angle. So now we can say that this intersection point here corresponds to the intersection point I have on my new ray. We need to create a second intersection point. To do that, we're going to bring back the compass. We're going to open it up to the distance from these two intersection points on the original angle and we say place it with the point on the intersection of our new angle where the arc and the initial ray meet and we can draw a second arc and that second arc gives us an intersection which I will now draw my second ray. And this is my angle B. I'm just going to use my protractor to verify the angle measurements are the same. I put my center of my protractor on the vertex of the angle. I line up the horizontal line with one of the sides of the angle. And I follow it up and I see that the second ray goes through the 60 degree mark. I go back to my original angle. I line up the center of the protractor with the vertex. I have the ray going through the zero line and the second ray going through the 60 degree line. We can say that angle A is congruent to angle B.